In this video, I will create software cluster in Package Designer. Right click the project, select Adaptive Package Designer. For next step, I will create software cluster of PAA and RAA on the basis of previously created application in root of software cluster. Right click in root, select add software cluster. Create the AR package name software cluster. Change the name to Software Cluster PAA. Enter the version as 1.0.0.0.01. Enter 79 for vendor ID. For signature, select My Certificates, which is created in Machine Designer. For next, I will add executable for packaging. Select PAA here. We can find executable is created. Next, I will add manifest execution. Also select PAA here. We can find PAA process is added as well. Next, I will add service instance. Select interface of skeleton. You can find service instance is created. For next, I will create vehicle package of proxy. Right click the root, select add software cluster. Change the name to software cluster. RAA and version is 1.0.0.001. For vendor ID, I enter 79. For signature, I select my certificates, which I created in machine design. I will add executable in the same way. Select RAA here. You can see the executable is created. Next, I will add manifest execution. Select RA8 as well. We can see that RAA process is created. Then I will create service instance. Select interface of some IP proxy. We can see that service instance is created. The next part will be creating software package. Select software package in config tree, right click in the table, then select add software package. Change the name of software package to PAA. For software cluster, I select PAA. Signature is my certificate. 
action type is install IS Delta package is false and I enter 79 for ID. Regarding the package size, I enter 1024 for compressed size, and 2048 for decompressed size. Actually this part depends on the requirements. In practice, developers need to enter the actual package size. For the UCM version, I enter 1.0.0.0 for the minimum, and the same for the maximum. For activation action, I select Restart Application, and select False, for Pre-Activation Reboot, and Post Verification Reboot. So PAA software package is created. I will create RAA software package as well. Select software package in the config tree. Right click in the table. Select add software package. For AR package, I select software cluster. Change the name of software package to RAA. I select RAA for software cluster, my certificate for signature, and choose install for action type, false for IS Delta package. The ID is 79. Here the same, 1020 for, for compressed size, and 2048 for decompressed size. The supporting UCM version is 1.0.0.0 for minimum, and maximum as well. I select Restart Application for Activation Action, False for both Pre-Activation Reboot, and Post Verification Reboot. So, RAA Software Package is finished. So far, the example of data exchanged between two software packages of PAA and RAA through a service interface is created. We can find and check the example in the saved ARXML file.